Hey guys, Joe Hancock here with Fit Philosophy. So I wanted to talk for a second about motivation and the good parts and sometimes the bad parts about motivation. For instance, I have a client who is tremendously motivated, just started with me, showing up four days, well, six days a week really. It's four days, one off, four on, one off. The typical cycle that I prescribe to begin with and then we kind of tune it in as uh, we determine how well the, the individual can recover. Um, one of the things that is come to mind is this particular person seems to want more. Um, they want more volume. They seem to be surprised when we're done with each session, even if the workout was difficult and they were huffing and puffing. And that's simply because they're like tremendously motivated, which I love, except that I can't give him the volume and the intensity that he wants right now because I don't want to injure him. And so this particular individual, I've had to reel back a little bit which is not a bad thing. That's actually a really great thing. It's, it's better for me as a trainer to deal with somebody who's more motivated to better themselves and to increase their fitness and to grow than somebody who I'm constantly having to kick in the ass. And of course, as we all know, you know, motivation fades off and then it becomes an issue about dedication. You know, motivation is what you started. Dedication and discipline is what keeps you going. So I just thought I'd throw it out there. Um, those of you who are motivated who want to go in and just jump right into the most intense thing ever, what I would invite you to do is understand that you need to work up to these things. You have to come in gradually, let your body become acclimated to finally moving, especially if you've been previously living in a sedentary lifestyle. Um, it's really important for your health. It's really important for the success of your program, and it's really important for your well-being overall and allowing your body to recover and allowing your body to grow stronger. That's it.